Hey guys, this is Ricky from Rickety's Productions here again, and I'm here with a Sony Xperia Z3 hands-on, and I'm also giving my first impressions on it as well. So first thing I want to talk to you guys is about the specs. Uh, this is a Sony phone, obviously. It's running 4.4.4 Android. Uh, it's got a 5.2 inch screen, uh, which is 1080 by the way, 1080 by 1920. It actually looks really good. It's 424 PBI, and of course it is an LCD screen as well. The camera on here uh, in the back is 20.7 megapixels, so you got a really good camera on here, a lot of megapixels in there, and a 2.2 front-facing megapixel camera. The system chip inside of here, you got a Snapdragon 801, quad-core obviously, with 2.5 gigahertz, an Adreno 330 as your graphics processor, and 3 gigs of RAM, so you know this thing is kind of a beast with specs. Um, the storage you get with these are 16 and 32 gigabyte models. You as well have a 3100 milliamp battery. Now the next thing I want to talk to you about is actually the integration with PlayStation, which kind of is a big thing for most people. Now you can remote play with your uh, Sony phone uh, for your PS4. So it's basically like streaming uh, the gameplay that you have on your PS4 onto your phone. It's kind of you can do this with, uh, or I think you can do this with the PS3 as well. Um, if you have if you have a PS Vita, you know what I'm talking about. It's just you can play it on your phone, and it's just streaming towards uh, your phone, which is a really nice thing. A lot of people are gonna like, um, and you can see here in the video that it, we're demonstrating that. Um, as well, this phone is waterproof, and if you can see here, there's a couple flaps on the side. Um, those flaps contain the micro SIM, the micro SD card, and your uh, micro USB charging slot. Now, um, while using this phone, we compared it kind of to the Galaxy S5 of having to open these things. They're a little more obtrusive than the actual Galaxy, than the uh, than the Galaxy. So that's a bad thing about this phone. With that Snapdragon 801, though, you got a great speed. The phone runs so fast it's just it really the experience with it is awesome as well as the screen the screen is gorgeous i looked at it and i was just amazed like this is a really nice screen it is 1080p but it looks really awesome as well the build with it is really nice uh it's both sides are glass um and it has this curve on the side that makes it kind of feel like one it's almost like the iphone and here we also have the 1m8 uh compared to the Xperia Z3 with the song, uh, let, let that play for you. Now you can tell here that uh, the Xperia Z3 sounds a little more clear to me personally. Uh, a little, it's a little scratchy on the HTC One M8, and the uh, Xperia Z3 also has front-facing speakers as well, so that's a really nice. And also, you can see here we found this little neat feature you can do with the camera. It adds like little environmental things. So here you can have like a dinosaur area, or you can even have water on the ground, and it's just kind of a little nice features you can do with the camera. And of course the camera is really nice with that 21.3 megapixel uh, camera, and it's a Sony one, so you know it's going to be good. So the Xperia Z3 right now is exclusive to T-Mobile. T-Mobile, it is 630 full retail price. Um, you can do, of course, a plan for 24 months with them for 26 25 a month uh, for two years, and uh, you can pay that off, you know, sequentially. Thanks for joining me in this uh, hands-on of the Xperia Z3. Remember to like the video if you liked it and subscribe to see more coverage of Android phones and we'll see you later.